so this is going to be my very first vlog. I'm going to be doing this over the summer. I'm not sure how many I'm going to do a week or um, how long each vlog is. I don't really know anything. I've been watching a lot of YouTubers and just been really interested in the whole YouTube culture and um, vlogging and kind of documenting. Um, I'm really interested in the editing of the video. If anybody that knows me that's watching this knows that I am a hobby hopper. So I go between hobby and hobby and hobby. I've done um, knitting, sewing, pottery, beer brewing, cage fighting. I get really bored really easily. This is kind of the secondary thing that I have to do. I've got to get content so that I can edit it. I'm really interested in the editing process. So I thought that I would start vlogging over the summer instead of just sitting around watching Netflix. So today is going to be my very first vlog. I'm going to be doing the unboxing of this camera right here, which is the Canon G7X. Just bought this today. So I bought this camera um, to vlog and to do some other things while we travel. Um, but also, I'm going to be just talking about my day and just kind of experimenting with this whole vlogging thing and seeing how I like it. So that's it for right now. Um, stay tuned to see how we go. Being sent out on a uh, mission by my wife to go get her some vodka because she's been studying all day and I uh, would like a uh, martini at night. And of course, since it's summertime, I thought I'd take the old Vespa. Love this thing. Got it on Craigslist for like $700. Not a bad deal. about this neighborhood. It is so close to everything. Literally have a grocery store within walking distance and then I went to go get vodka and it took um, five minutes. Love, love it. So right now I'm just going to be vlogging on my iPhone until I can get, um, I'm waiting for the battery to charge on my Canon. Um, I'm not really sure how I feel about this vlogging thing. This whole, this situation, holding this up like this is just, um, I don't know, it seems a bit uh, egocentric to be talking to myself in public. I don't mind doing it at home, but you know, when I'm watching a vlog, you forget that this, you know, like very intimate, it seems like a one-on-one -on -one conversation. It's literally a guy or girl walking down the street with this giant, in fact, let me get this GoPro so you can kind of, you can kind of get a sense of what this looks like. This is what I look like whilst vlogging and it'll be even more ridiculous when I have a, a little bit larger camera on the end of this. Um, I'm not sure if that's something that goes away as you continue to vlog or if that's just something you just kind of have to ignore is the fact that you're um, kind of a crazy person talking to the camera. I'm gonna give it a try um, over the summer. I'm not sure if it'll continue when school starts but I'd like to try it. I like new hobbies, like new things to do. Um, it's better than sitting around just watching television, especially the editing part of it. I've edited several videos this summer, um, the one we went to Colorado and then the Mexico trip, and I've really enjoyed the editing process of the video. The videoing process is not my favorite. It's kind of um, self-reflective, I guess, which is not something I normally do. And so in honor of my vlogging, my first ever First ever vlog, I'm going to be unboxing a Canon G7X um, point and shoot. Um, I'm shooting right now on a Canon Rebel T3i and my iPhone. So um, I saw a lot of YouTubers were using this PowerShot G7X right here. So um, let's jump right into it. I usually use my uh, Kershaw, um, it's disappeared, so I'm going to be using a uh, Swiss Army knife. <coughs> So first things first, let's see what we got here. Looks like we've got the warranty card. Next up we've got the PowerShot G7X Getting Started Guide. After that we've got, looks like, the battery. Smaller battery. I do wish it was the same battery as my Canon 
Rebel, but it's okay. I'll just get on Amazon and get some more. So we've got a battery. We also have a, looks like a lanyard. If you're uh, prone to be dropping things. Let's see. Uh, the cream de la resistance. We'll wait on that. Inside here, I do believe is going to be the power charger. So that's everything out of the box. Get that out of the way. But great. I love how Canon does these. Where there's no cord. You just turn that, plug it into the wall. Super great right there. So we've got that. It's got our battery right there. And now the uh, what I really want to open this up for is the camera. All right, so this is for sheer comparison of my three different cameras I'm using. Um, so right here, I've got the Canon Rebel T3i. Um, right here, I've got the Canon G7X, the Mark One, And right here, I've got the iPhone 7 um, S Plus, or Plus S, or however you say it. Um, just to get a comparison between the iPhone, Canon G7X, and a DSLR Canon um, Rebel. So. Just a comparison to see how that goes. Hey guys, I've just finished up the edits on our first vlog. Um, it's taken a lot longer than I thought it has, so it's actually a couple days later. I've also finished the edits on my second vlog that I'll probably be posting after I post this one. I'd appreciate subscriptions if you're not subscribed, thumbs up. And if you have any comments or tips or things you'd like to see, comment down below. Thanks for tuning in. See you guys next time.